Quebec is the eastern version of Canada. And it's actually still part of Canada, but at times they actually try to distance themselves from Canada. Oh, Canada. And it's kind of cold up there. And a lot of people, they're just like, they're trying to be like uh, European or uh, French people. And I was there only like one time for about 10 days in around March and April 2006 because I was doing um, uh, ministry with the Word of Life Bible Institute. And it was something required to graduate from my two-year Bible college at the Word of Life Bible Institute that I was in. The first college that I went to right after high school, I flew in an airplane. I was able to get a plane ticket for my uh, my friends, these missionaries, Pete and Debbie Stale, and they were able to save my life and get me over there. Uh, in a way, they were like saving my life or opening me up to new opportunities, and so I was able to go there, and that was very actually exciting because you know first I was homeschooled and I was going I was and then I was able to go to high school and, and I was involved with all these different ministries and camps and, and then I was able to go to the other side of the United States you know because I was born in Oregon which is above California I was able to fly in an airplane after I graduated high school like two weeks after I graduated high school I flew in an airplane for my first time in an airplane to New York um, a few hours north of New York City in upstate New York near Albany was in uh, Pottersfield which is near Scroon Lake and I go to uh, Word of Life Bible Institute you know it's a college where we study about uh, the Bible and also you know things that really are applicable sociology, psychology, anthropology, theology, Christology, and angelology all these different ologies um, to study of this, to study of that about p how people think how people do things, why people do things, you know, when they're alone and with other people and social settings and all these different things about how to be a teacher, tutor, a leader, a father, a lover, a designer. Uh, mostly, you know, about, you know, charity work, missionary work, um, learning how people think and how to really um, impact people and motivate people, inspire people to become better people and how to help people. And uh, one of those things that we were doing um, in the different things that we're learning in school was uh, learning how to, you know, go to another country and do things for them, do some charity. Uh, and so we went there for about 10 days in Quebec and uh, the people, the people speak uh, French and uh, there was like some old buildings and I was, e I was able to eat some uh, escarto, I think it's like a snail and um, we were able to do different um, things for people like we had uh, different uh, shows uh, where we try to tell a story to people through uh, uh, drama you know we do like a play like a small uh, like video except with like live action like a play and, uh, and, and puppet show and uh, different songs we sing to people to try to you know motivate them to become better people or to accept Christ into their lives um, you know good things like that we try to you know help people to see the better things in life and, and we also learned about the culture of, of, um, of Quebec and it was kind of interesting to see and to imagine I think so and that's about it life is always full of surprises you should never give up, never surrender, never back down. Quebec is kind of Quebec-y. I don't really know it a lot. It's kind of cold.